Hey everybody, this is Lori again, and I'm here doing another video response for a challenge that I'm participating in. And uh, this challenge is being hosted by Tina's Cricut Create. And this is um, a, either a tag or a card giveaway challenge. So Tina's rules are that you must be a subby. Um, it is only open to her US subscribers. You are to make a card or a tag, and somewhere on that um, project you need to put the letter T. And you have to use at least two stamps. So you'll get one entry for doing a video response, and if you mail her the card, you'll get two more entries. And the video response is due by March 5th, and she's going to draw the winner on March the 12th. So I will link Tina's original uh, video giveaway video in my description box so check out her channel you guys she's very nice um, makes a lot of beautiful cards as well so let me uh, just show you the things that I used because I made a card surprise surprise <laughs> um, I used the My Mind's Eye dolled up paper collection I love everything in this collection every pattern paper it's just um, Especially those the wooden ones. Love that. And for my stamp, I used um, Swiss Pixies. So you can't really see it, but that's the, that's the stamp that I used. I used um, this here green trim, and this is Webster's Pages. So I used some of that. I used my chalk inks again. Um, I used white cardstock and I used this. This is a green one from Paper Tray Ink. That it's called New Leaf. And I love their cardstock because it's thick and um, yeah, just really good quality cardstock. So yeah, oh, and I used um, I Am Roses flowers and yeah, and I used oh, wait, I used the ovals scallop ovals and just regular ovals yeah and I use this punch by Fiskars and this one uh, this is a corner punch and I use the Martha Stewart um, butterfly punch so that is everything that I use to create my card so let me just get this stuff out of the way okay so this is my card that I created for Tina and uh, I, initially, I thought it was, I don't know, I've been making so many birthday cards that I was like almost about to stamp happy birthday but then I realized it's not a birthday card challenge, it's just a regular card challenge. Oh, sorry you guys. Okay, so um, this card is 6x6 six six, and uh, I've put uh, a few layers, one, two, three, like three or four layers on this card. Um, I just cut my my uh, white paper six by six. I layered that green cardstock right here, and then pattern paper, and then another um, pattern paper. So, and this is my um, scallop that I used. Here's that Fisker's punch right there. There's the Webster's Pages trim, very beautiful. Uh, for some reason, my last two cards I went with like green. Um, yeah. But, you know, it's almost spring. Mm. So, this is my image. I love her. She's so super cute. I've used her many, many times. Um, I love most of the Swiss Pixies, actually. It's very cute. Um, so, yeah, I just colored her up with Copic markers and used the chalk inks again to create my sky and the grass. I tried to match her dress color with this um, pattern paper, with this color, so it almost matched. I used some uh, I Am Roses Carnations. This green one here is Recollections. Oh, and I this here um, corner, this is a punch. So yeah, use that one. Then I just put some more butterflies, um, some pearl Recollections bling. I love, this is probably one of my most favorite flowers from I Am Roses, is this, it's almost like those um, tea roses I think they're called, or trellis roses, 
And here's my T, and I used the Scrabble tile, and I just, um, you know, dabbed it with some white paint because I didn't want it to be too brown. Some more butterflies, a little bit of a pearl bling there. Um, stickles, of course, all over the card. Yeah, and then I finished the inside as well. And that's that corner punch. This one. So it looks like that. And I'll just write a little note to her. And uh, yeah, and there's the back. And that's handmade by. So yeah, this is my entry for Tina's challenge. And uh, head over to her channel, you guys. And there's still some time to participate. And yeah. So thank you so much for watching, everyone. And have a great day. Bye.